speaking about our children and what's going to happen to them in the future. As the federal government comes in and starts to hand down all kinds of laws, one of the laws that they want to dictate to us is how we should teach our children. We as the Nishnabe people and Umbohoi people do not wish the government to do this. Help us in our support so that we can defeat or at least change their mind on how they're going to implement these doctrines of honor.
you to know. Greetings, everybody. The Chief Joliet from Matter Nation of the Dan, the Wolf Clan. And we're here today to protest against the imposition of yet another piece of legislation upon the peoples of this land. This act does nothing to address the already existing inequalities in the education levels and funding levels between First Nations people and everybody else in Canada. The system is broken. And the minister says that if it continues to be broken, he will step in. How can you fix something when it doesn't have the correct resources to it in the first place? No promises of equivalent funding to the provincial levels. Only promises of only promises of taking over. This is something that we wish support from from all our uh, Canadian friends. This act does nothing except impose more colonialism upon our peoples. We've already had enough of that. It's time for negotiation. It's time to fix what is broken, and it's time to allocate the proper resources. We're tired of being second-class citizens in our own territories. We don't get that benefit of any of the resources. We're shunted upon lands that were deemed inferior to other lands. This is the kind of stuff that we had to put up with for hundreds of years. So we need all your support to change things. If there's any place that Canada should make an investment, it's in education. Only through education can our young people lift ourselves out of poverty to gain employment and to become contributing members of society. If we get half the money as everybody else does for education, how can you expect us to fix things the way they are now? Only through meaningful discussion and dialogue can the system be fixed. And that's something that has not happened yet. Please join us in supporting our cause and to fix our education system. Imposition of legislation won't fix anything. Negotiating and talking well. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. 